We all live in a comfort bubble. We love our comfort zone. We have the same routines. We wake up in the morning, have the same coffee, do the groceries in the same supermarket. We meet the same friends, the same people. We go to the same coffee shop or pub or club. We love our comfort zone. Nothing wrong with that, but if you wanna grow, if you wanna change, if you wanna succeed, you have to step out of that bubble. You have to expand the bubble. Life begins outside of your comfort zone. So step outside of your comfort zone and step into your courageous zone. And that's what this video is all about. I'm gonna explain three C's that you can apply right away to start creating the life that you desire. Just like I'm doing here, I'm creating my dream life. Now I'm gonna go inside because there's too much wind and chilping birds everywhere. Step out of your comfort zone. It's time to step out of your comfort zone. Take action and step out of that comfort bubble. I want to talk about two myths and reveal the truth. And then I want to talk about three steps to be able to step out of your comfort zone and be that courageous leader that you are. If you want to change, you need to step out of your comfort zone. It's as simple as that. So what are these two myths? The conventional wisdom is that, oh, well, with enough inspiration, you'll get there, you'll be able to step out of your comfort zone. Really? No. It's not anyone or just with some inspiration that you can step out of your comfort zone. The truth is that anyone can do it, but you have to have more than just inspiration. You need to put in the effort. You need to have a strategy. You need to have a plan. You need to, if you want to grow and achieve something and reach that end goal of you, you have to have a plan. You have to take the steps towards it. So it's not just, oh, I have inspiration and then I can step out of my comfort zone and achieve things. No. Myth number two. Oh, just take the leap of faith. Just do it. Follow your heart. Oh my gosh, how many times have I heard that? Just follow your heart, follow your passion and just do it. Just take a leap. Oh, please do not. I always tell my clients, be, you know, yes, you have to know what is deep inside of you, what your intention is, what your purpose is, what your heart is pumping for what your passion is, yes. And yes, you have to know what your strengths and capabilities are, but then there's a plan, there's a process, there's a, a strategy. It's not just, oh, just leave your career and just quit and then just start doing what you love. No, it's not that easy. I took steps, I quit my corporate job, I, I did some teaching, I, you know, I'm, I'm taking steps and finally I can say, yes, I have the freedom life that I desire and that I created for myself. But it took effort, it took planning and it takes, yeah, work. There's no secret. So those are the two conventional wisdom myths. So what? What are the three steps that you can really overcome your comfort zone? The first thing is, well, it's actually three C's. I'm gonna reveal the three C's. Conviction, clarity, and create the change. Conviction, clarity, create the change. So what is the first one? Conviction. Conviction is, is that clarity. It's that faith. It's that belief inside of you that you can achieve the things that you want and that you desire. It's the conviction. It's that unwavering faith. It's the trust in yourself that that whatever is your dream and your goal, that you can do it. Trust yourself, believe in yourself and be convinced without being convinced. If you're full of self-doubt and limiting beliefs, which is something I talk about a lot and I help my clients through that process. If you're full of limiting beliefs and doubts, you're not going to take the step out of your comfort zone. You're not going to take the step towards your goal. You're not because you're staying stuck in fear and doubt of yourself. So one is conviction. Two is the clarity. The clarity also comes with the language that you speak to yourself. The clarity of your own identity statement. Let me explain. If I keep telling myself I'm a fake, I'm not good enough, I can't do this, I can't, I can't. What's gonna happen? Nothing, because I can't, <laughs> right? But if I have a thought in my mind and it's clear like, yeah, I can do this. I can try this. I'm going to try this. I'm going to put the effort into it. I'm going to achieve it. I can do this. Other people do it. I can do it too. I'm going to put every step and every ounce of faith that I have into it. I'm going to do it. Yeah, I can. I'm seeing the glass half empty or I'm seeing the glass half full. So it's that clarity, that statement. I feel false. No, 
no, I trust myself. So beat that inner critic and move forward with a clear language. Yeah, you know, I, I, I made a video about this as well, about your, your um, identity statement. So the more I told myself when I was still in corporate, like, oh yeah, I'm, I'm a manager, I'm a commercial manager and, and yeah, I don't like what I do, but that's who I am. The more I said that, the more I stayed stuck. But once I said, no, I'm an entrepreneur and I'm a digital and I'm traveling the world and I'm doing what I love. I started changing that statement in my mind and that's when things started shifting, huge shifts, because I started telling the person who I wanted to be, who I was meant to be and not the person who I was stuck. So if you're telling yourself, yeah, I'm not good enough. This is, this is the position where I'm at right now. And that's, you know, who I am. You're going to stay there. Start shifting like, yeah, I'm growing. I'm whatever, fill in the blank, whatever you want to be. That's the clear language you need to tell yourself. And then the third C, so we have conviction, clarity, and create change. Yeah, that's it. Put in the effort. I talk about it all the time. You have to put in the effort. You have to take action. You have to take action or nothing will happen. You can sit back and think, oh, they're doing so well. And, and I really wish I had that, but yeah, but yeah, here I am. <laughs> and nothing's going to happen. You have to take the action to move outside of your comfort zone. And you know what? Change is the enemy of comfort. Change is the enemy of comfort. But if you want change, if you want transformation, you need to step out of your comfort bubble and do it. Yeah, that's it. That's it. It's as simple as that. You know, take small steps daily. You know, every small step creates a compound effect. There's even a book written about that. When I was writing my book, it's like every paragraph, you know, when I'm doing a speech, it's, 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 it's preparing it, it's rehearsing it in front of a, a few people and then a bigger people and then a big stage and then a TEDx stage. You know, it's, it's all these small steps. When I was in the beginning, you know, making, I started on YouTube and all the people were like, oh my gosh, YouTube, it's so huge. What are you going to do on YouTube? But I started, I started creating videos. They sucked, but I just did it and I get better and better and better. And I'm still learning and I'm still improving. I still have a long ways to go, but at least I'm taking action outside of my comfort zone and just growing and growing and growing your action steps. I want you to comment below. What are the things that you're going to start doing today to step out of your comfort bubble? What are the small things you're going to do to mess up? What are these things? I want you to comment below. Second thing, if you still think like, yeah, but I don't know what to do with my life. I'm stuck. I don't know. I know I want to change, but I don't know how. Then I want you to grab that free training right below to get you unstuck. It's a link right below. It's a free gift, free training, and it will help you with seven steps to get unstuck. If you haven't done so already, I want you to subscribe to this channel. Don't forget and get new videos all the time. And also watch the next video that's going to appear right away because if you want to create the life you desire, watch it.